Are you on a bath today? You are? Okay. Well, we're getting ready to have one in just a minute. Okay? Say, hey, Lily. This is Lily, and we're getting ready to have a bath. You want a bath? Okay. I'm actually going to videotape it. This is going to be fun. She likes baths. All right. I'm going to let you down so we can get the water ready. Okay. Lily, you ready for a bath today? Well, what we're going to do is make sure that we have the house good and warm. We don't want her to take a bath and then get out and be shivering. I'm going to have the water ran already about that much in the bathtub. So when we get ready to place her in the water, that she won't be scared from the running the water. We don't want to have any noise. So we want to have everything prepared like towels and the shampoo that she likes and things like that. So I'm going to go ahead and let her run for just a minute. I'm going to get everything set up. She's trying to bite me. And uh, then you get to see her take a bath. All righty, Lily, get down. All right, let's get our items together. Okay, so I'm back. I've got towels ready on hand. Um, when she's finished taking the bath, I don't want to have to start running and looking for towels and things like that. So you want to have it on hand because she's going to be cold getting out of the water. Um, I've, I use this cup and I go ahead and put whatever shampoo that I want to use um, for my choice for my cat. So just a little bit. So it will be on hand. Everything should be ready because uh, even though she doesn't mind the water so much, uh, you don't want to be wasting time when you get, get her in that water and scrubbing her. Okay, so I've got my... Um, Hair dryer over there on the floor, ready so when I take her out, I can blow dry her a little bit, get some of that dampness off after, of course, we towel, um, towel dry her. All right, she's actually sitting below the tripod, so she's ready for her bath. Um, my other cat, Daisy, she wouldn't even come in here. She hates the sound of water, so Lily's not bad, but I'm going to show you that she likes baths. Of course, I mean, I have to hold her a little bit, but other than that, she doesn't go crazy and scream and, and run off and claw me. All right, so I've got my water in, like I said, about that much. Good and warm, not hot. You, want to, you don't want to burn them. I've got a rinsing cup, just a little simple cup, plastic cup. You don't want anything glass because it could shatter. Um, so anyway, I'm ready, so I'm going to get her. She's right here below me, ready to dive in. So um, I'll probably be wet when I'm finished, so... Never mind me. Just look at that. Uh, look at Lily. All right, let me get my towels and hang on. All right, Lily, you ready? Okay, I got towels here. Let me open them up. Okay. I know you're ready. Okay, you ready, sugar? You ready? You ready for your bath? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yes, see? You like your baths. You like your baths. So we're going to rinse her a little bit and get some water on her. Yes, Lily, you're doing good, sugar. You're doing good. Of course, your sister, Daisy, would probably be clawing the blood out of me right now. You're doing good, sugar. So I'm just really uh, getting her good and wet with this cup. Yes, you're doing good, sweetheart. You're doing good. Okay. I'm not going to do near her face because I don't want to get stuck in her eyes. Okay, I've got her tail. I've got her belly. Now I'm going to take just a little bit of the shampoo. I'm going to put a little bit of water in it to sort of thin it down. Just put a little bit on her back here. Okay, I'm coming, sweetie. All right, so there's our shampoo. I'm going to rub it in good. Yes, you like your shampoo. You're spoiled. You are spoiled. Okay, so that's enough for now. Just to give her. Okay, so this is this good. I know it feels good for her. She's strictly indoors. She does not go out. I do not want her picking up any fleas. You're doing good, darling. I'm going to rub her belly. I'm going to rub her good. 
You're feeling good, you should have Stay on my side. So, anyway, I'll wash her face afterwards, maybe look like with a washcloth, or I'll towel it, and I'll, I'm not going to let the water drain right now because it will frighten her and she'll scream. We don't want her screaming and scratching. So I'm going to squeeze her paws real gently just to get a little bit of the water out. See? Just squeeze it gently. Like that. Okay. Just get some of this water off, squeeze it. Squeeze this gently on her tail to get some of the water out of that. I know as we are. I know you. I got a, I got a towel for you. Ready? Okay. So I've got my towel down here. Ready? Let me squeeze the back of her legs. I'm going to squeeze it real gently. And she's not declawed, so okay, I'm going to squeeze her leg. Get that water out. Yes, baby, you're doing good. Yes. And there she is. I'll wash her face separately. So I'm going to um, put the towel on her. Uh, there's Here she is. She's wrapped in the towel. I didn't get too wet this time. I was just doing more of a little sample bath for you. Not a longer one that I usually do. So I'm going to sort of fluff dry towel dry her. Can you see her? You may not can see her. Okay, see? I just get some of that excess water off. See, she likes baths. Not all do, believe me. But you're a good kitty. She's about seven months old. I think when we first got her, she we um, got it from um, a house down the road who had free kittens and when we got her she was more or less in and out she was was about I don't know a month or two old but she was eat up with fleas so we brought her home and we gave her flea baths whoops hold on baby okay so I'm gonna just put her down and what I'll do is I'll just gently blow dry her just a little bit not hot we don't want it really really hot we don't want to burn her. and that's that so I hope you enjoyed the the cat bath video. See, I didn't get too too wet, just a little bit. All right, y'all have a blessed day. Bye.